you'll know when I'm driving down the street. You guys didn't know, now you know. I got picked up by Echo Vision. Broke my foot. What is up everybody? So I'm here with my 2017 Nissan GTR. This has been my dream car my entire life. So I finally went out and bought it. It's been completely stock up to this point besides the exhaust, but I'm gonna talk to you guys a little bit about this car and what I'm gonna be doing to it. So we'll start under the hood. Okay, so if you guys didn't know, every GTR engine is hand built by someone in Japan. And so this one was built by none other than Tsunemi Uyama. <laughs> probably butchered that. Every Japanese person is probably freaking dying on the inside. We're gonna go full bolt on E85, which means that we're gonna go the down pipes, the mid pipe and the exhaust stage two or three tune. And then we're also gonna go in the upgraded air intakes right now. I think they're two and a half inch right now and we'll be going to the three inch. The wheels are completely stock. I do love the way that they look, but if you're gonna be building the car, then we kind of need to do a complete makeover. So I am undecided on the wheels right now. I'm sure I'll make a great choice because I usually do. So if you look the side skirts on the car and you look at the rear, it's clean, it's professional with a spoiler, but it's a GTR. And if you have a GTR, you have to make it your own because that's what why people want this car. So we're gonna be ending up taking away that gay little diffuser, cancel me, whatever. We're gonna be putting a real diffuser on it. We're gonna be putting side skirts on it and a lip on the front. Um, the exhaust is gonna stay the same. We'll probably debadge this. And then the back looks super clean as is, but it's a GTR, it's Godzilla. Like you gotta put a spoiler on it. So we're gonna put some type of spoiler on this thing. The car is currently sitting around like 575 pounds of horsepower. 575 pounds of horsepower. 575 pounds of horsepower. Okay. Give him too much, bro. <laughs> <laughs> bro, that's just always thinking about dumbbells yeah. and gin weights. It's currently sitting at 575 horsepower right now. I'm trying to get it around like seven to 800 to the wheels. I'm gonna do is wrap as well, but I don't know what color I wanna do. The white looks really clean, professional, but we need to make it a little spicy, you know, a little bit of zest on this thing. So give it two, three weeks, maybe a month, and this car is gonna be looking completely different. You'll know when I'm driving down the street. All right. Take off the fufu, take off the clouches, take off the wifi, take off the money phone, take off the car loan, take off the flex and the white loss, take off the weird ass drip, I'ma take this step, then I'm taking off top five. Take off perception, take off the cop with the hot pad Take off the hunger, take off the unsure, take off the solutions I'm mad take, take off the fake deep, take off the fake boat, take off the humble cock Take it off, take off the passive, take off the new logic We are back at the compound, we're going to be hitting back today But we're kind of walking with a limp because I broke my foot So we'll be hobbling around the gym today I'm not gay, so I'm not wearing that boot that they gave me. We just got regular shoes on. We're just trying to keep the foot straight. And then also, if you guys didn't follow my journey, I said I was hopping on Slin. I'm not on Slin anymore. I did it for like a week, and I was just traveling too much to Houston. I've been in Houston like three times in the last two weeks. So I'm not on Slin. I'm just on the normal cycle. Just thought I'd give you guys a little update on that. But we're going to go hit back. So Rio's about to drop a sick ass edit in like three, two, one. Grab the tape recorder, JVC, just to hear the screams. Got my busty blade, all the same, just to make you bleed. I'm a cop. Pretty much, shout out to Transcend HRT. Without them, none of this would be possible. If you guys are looking to get your blood work done, if you guys need cycle supports, TRT, PCTs, because a lot of people don't know how to do that shit, hit up Transcend. There's a link down below for you guys. Also, as you can tell, we're kind of plateauing on this cycle right now. I wanted to give you guys kind of like a physique update. You guys saw the posing clips. Um, we're kind of stalled out on like 235 to 240, like right in there. Um, we got like six weeks left of this bulk. I fucked up my toe. Don't know what we're gonna do with that shit because can't really hit legs that hard. It's just a lot of extensions, a lot of curls, but uh, it is what it is. Let's make the most of it. But I think we're just gonna increase the dosages and uh, I'm just kidding, we're not doing that shit. We're not research cam. As you guys know, I got picked up by Echo Vision. 
If you guys didn't know, now you know. You have no excuse, all right? So go run up my code on EchoVision, code Marcus, because it's better than code Dylan or code O'Brien or whatever he is because Dylan's low-key gay. So run up code Marcus. Uh, we got a lot of bodybuilding products that we're coming out with. Uh, M, the owner, is giving me the opportunity to uh, come out with their bodybuilding line. So the first one we're coming out with is like a liver and kidney support type deal because all the other ones on the market are pretty mid, to be honest. So he's letting me formulate it. That'll be out probably the next four, six, eight weeks max. And then from there, we're going to keep just going on with different kind of supplements that you guys want, supplements you guys need. Super stoked for that. We're going to Houston in a couple weeks, so we'll be able to meet up with them again. Anyways, appreciate you guys. Like, comment, subscribe. I appreciate you guys' support, whether it's here, Instagram, TikTok, even if you're just liking the video, it means the most. And uh, we'll catch you guys in the next one. Thank you.